Hey, what's up everyone? How you all doing? So just a really quick short video on a little bit of Warframe news that just came to light. Let me know how you feel about having moddable exalted weapons. Not what we have right now, which is exalted weapons that are affected by the mods that are equipped on your melee, secondary or primary weapons, but being actually able to put mods on your exalted blade or maces, uh, regulators and so on. Because according to Rebecca on Twitter, this is more than likely going to be a thing in Warframe pretty soon. So this is what she said. The dev build on Warframe has the experimental changes for separately moddable exalted weapons, i.e. Warframes with weapons as powers. If testing and such goes well, they are really hoping that they can add this into the game and that Venari was a good gateway. Now, the definition of a good gateway might not be the same for them as it is for the rest of the community. I'm sure some of you love the idea of this and some of you really don't. She also goes on later on to say that there shouldn't be a conflict of mods being shared between exalted weapons and normal weapons. So you should be able to share the same mods on normal weapons as you do on your exalted ones, like primed crit mods and so on. Take Mesa and her Peacemaker ability as an example. Now, right now, your pistol mods affect the damage dealt by those regulator pistols. But after this change, your pistol mods won't affect it, but you can still share the same mods on your Mesa's regulator pistols. That all sounds great, not having to share mods and not having to use your normal weapons as basically just a shell to house the mods in order to make your exalted weapons a little bit more powerful. You'll be able to mod those exalted weapons separately, which it does sound really good. However, the major issue with this for me is that you're now probably going to have to sync multiple forma into exalted weapons in order to get the same build that you're using right now. So for instance, if you're using a set of pistols on your Mesa, and you have five former on those pistols in order to fit all of those primed crit mods on and so on, then chances are you will also need four or five former on mace as regulators as well to get that exact same build. Or you're gonna have to put multiple mods on Valkyr's Claws or Excalibur's Exalted Blade or Wukong's Big Stick and so on. So this means that Exalted Warframes, just Warframes with Exalted abilities, could need up on seven or eight former or more between each of them in order to make them work. So does this excite you? Does the idea of being able to separately mod those exalted weapons excite you or maybe having to use all of those former? We could do with a little bit more information. It was kind of just a random tweet, I think, by Rebecca. Like, will we now get additional mastery for each exalted weapon that we level, like we did with Venari and Korra? Will exalted augments move to the weapon or will they stay on the Warframe like Chromatic Blade for Excalibur? It would be nice to get these little bits of information and I'm sure we will over the next week or so. Now also another bit of information released today by Warframe is what quests you need in order to complete before the sacrifice quest actually arrives and this is them. So you're going to have to finish all of these quests off if you want to run the new quest once it drops. So maybe the sacrifice quest isn't as far away as a lot of us think it is. Maybe it's right around the corner or maybe it's not. Who knows? But share your thoughts on having moddable exalted weapons whether you like the idea of it or not in the comment section below do me a huge favor hit that like button if you enjoyed the video or don't if you didn't subscribe for more warframe and as always thanks very much for watching